Ticket is a Microsoft Teams ticketing system built exclusively for Office 365. Whether you're just getting by with Microsoft Tasks by Planner or looking for a simple way to turn your day-to-day -day conversations into actionable items, Ticket can do both of those and more. Let's start by turning things over to Diego here on the right. He's a member of our support team and wrapping a few things up for the day. But before he leaves, Adele over here on the left needs something. She's going to message Diego directly for help. Now, Diego could ignore this and get back to her tomorrow, but because he's got Ticket on his side, he can turn this message into trackable work. When he does this, Adele receives a notification that a ticket has been created on her behalf from HelpBot. Now, she can continue to update her ticket from here and even make new requests. But before we get into HelpBot, let's finish what Diego was in the middle of. So he created this ticket on Adele's behalf. He could immediately leave a comment. He could modify it. But what he's going to do, because he wants to be super helpful to the rest of his team, is train Ticket to perform deflection. So first, he's going to leave a reply. Then Diego's going to hit send and add to KB. This will do two things. One, Adele is going to receive a notification from HelpBot that a new comment has been added. And two, Diego is going to have the opportunity to cross-train Ticket to perform deflection going forward. He's going to change this to, I'm having an issue with email. And anytime this question is asked of HelpBot, HelpBot will respond with, make sure Outlook is in online mode first. He'll hit submit. And Ticket is now off for training its deflection knowledge base. Now let's turn things over to a different member of the organization. Joni is just starting her day, and she also is having an issue with email. And she's going to say, and HelpBot will now deflect based on what Diego has trained it to do. But this could be anyone in the support organization. Now, in the event that this isn't helpful, she can still move forward with creating a ticket. All she has to do is hit no, maybe provide some more context, and hit submit. Joni's new ticket has been created. It's 72, and it's active, and she can still continue to leave comments and update the support team with more information. But where do these tickets actually end up? Well, if we come back to Diego, Diego received a notification from Ticket that a new message has been posted to the triage channel. The triage channel is where everyone on his team can see everything that's going on with new tickets in the system. That means there's a common place to leave comments, reply, tag, and continue to improve ticket deflections without ever once leaving teams to do so. No new accounts, no new passwords, and 100% integrated with Teams and Azure Active Directory.